Father Jeff Bahi, Metanoia Manor, Louisiana. My name is Father Jeff Bahi. I'm the founder of Metanoia Incorporated. Metanoia has been founded to be a refuge and a rescue for juvenile victims of human trafficking. I met a nun by the name of Sister Eugenia Bonetti. She made me aware of this whole world I knew nothing about. That there are 38.7 million that we know of slaves worldwide. 89% of them sold into sex trafficking. In the state of Louisiana, 40% of the juveniles are trafficked by their primary caregiver, their mother, their father, their aunt, their uncle, their mother's boyfriend. Think about that. The people who are supposed to love you and take care of you are selling you. Interstate 10 coming through Louisiana is now recognized as one of the most active corridors for human trafficking in the United States. We have been able to identify in the year of 2017 over a thousand young girls who have been trafficked through Louisiana. And so through his efforts and through working with law enforcement and others, we're able to rescue these girls and give them a new life and bring them to a place like Metanoia Manor. In Metanoia Manor, our goal is, is to make these children feel like they're loved and they're wanted. We want them to have education. We want them to learn life skills. We want them to learn a lot of things that we took for granted growing up in the home. My role is a volunteer role. I go in once a week, twice a week, and I teach them things, how to, how to eat at table. I taught them to dye Easter eggs. Um, I, I teach them manners, and I'm beginning to teach them to balance a checkbook. My goal is to get them ready to go into the outside world, knowing that there is family out there, and they do belong. Metanoia Manor brings in safe families. Our family, my husband, my daughter, my son, we come to the house um, so that they can see what a family unit looks like. It changes their heart to realize that maybe one day they can also have a family, that they can go back into society, and that maybe one day they will have a husband, and they will have children, and they will be able to be providers. Hospital Sisters of Mercy are there to hold them in the middle of the night to provide spiritual guidance, provide educational guidance, to provide all the support that they need to really rebuild who they are and who they will become. Traditional group home settings have a performance base, have staff that rotates in and, and have different deficiencies for, for girls or for the residents. With Metanoia, it's a home. The nuns live there. They don't leave. They are the mother and the father. They are the family unit, which is a different model. And this is what the young girls need. They need a home and not a facility. Father Bahi is one of the most incredible men that I've met in my life. He uh, has a true compassion for these victims. But not only does he have the compassion, he's got the strength and the courage to do something about it. Father Jeff is receiving the Angel Award, but it should be a Warrior Award because what he's done to cross the boundaries to offer a safe home for these girls has taken a heart of a warrior.